soldier, huh, Ray? Another Tahitian tea for my friend, the vice president. And waitress, this time, no giggling. Can my friend have another bourbon bug's blood? Will he need a fresh bib? <laughs> How would you like a winner of the week? Check. What about a smoking hot Friday feline? Boom. What about a Friday funny fun fact? I got you. How about a funny joke of the day? Well, hey, uh... Three out of four ain't bad. Anyway, my name is Sean, also known as Bits of Real Panther. And I'd like to welcome you to another exciting installment of The Friday Funny, the funny joke of the day. Before we get started though, friends, please allow me to confide in you this one deep, dark secret. I am celebrating this evening, and truth be told, I'm a little intoxicated. Oh! Yeah, anyway, with that being said, let's get things going. Let's get this showboat moving, as they like to say, no word that I've heard of, with the winner of the week. Aww. Today's much coveted, much prized winner of the week trophy goes out to an Egyptian bus driver who submitted his urine for a routine drug test. Actually, it wasn't really his urine he submitted, it was his wife's. Now problems arose when the person testing the urine discovered that that male bus driver was in fact pregnant. When it comes to pregnancy stories, I don't think George Lucas could have written anything that stupid. Anyway, that is today's winner of the wee. You want a hot Friday feline? You got a hot Friday feline. Compliments of your friend, Bits of Real Panther. I always have your back. But before we get into that, please allow me to introduce this drink. Today, we will be drinking a Jim Beam straight bourbon. And I want to hurry with this because the smell alone is making my innards curl. I honestly have a feeling that this is going to taste like something out of a dead guy's butthole. And I'm no expert on such things, but I'm probably pretty close. Anyway, today's luscious Friday feline is an Elijah Dushku. You've probably heard of her. I've heard of her. She was suggested to us all by your friend and mine. Do Android's Dream. I, I can't really work in that new name yet. It's lit RPG, something about a dungeon master, something, I, I don't know what it is. Do Android Dream is what you will always be in my heart, friend. Anyway, today's drink goes out to Elijah Dushku. I should almost have a drum roll here. I've got a feeling this is going to suck on levels they haven't even invented yet. But let it be known, I have not a bucket here waiting, but an entire sink. So, good times to be had. <sighs> okay, Elijah Dushku. This one is for you. on the eyes and probably other places as well. Anyway, speaking of eyesight, today's little fun fact goes out to your friends and mine, pirates. That's right, pirates. It seems that pirates wore earrings, much like the one I am brandishing here, because they believed it improved their eyesight. Ooh. If only that were true, as I am blind as a mother. 
when it comes to the argument of whether or not alcohol actually makes things better, I think this video in particular should constitute Exhibit A. Anyway, last I have for you a little joke, but before I give you that little joke, let me say a warm, warm happy birthday to your friend and mine, Claire Defied. Apparently I have been mispronouncing it this entire time and my heart is riddled with guilt. I'm not sure if that's entirely true. Anyway, happy birthday, Claire Defied. Anyway, I'm going to give you a little joke when I deliver the punchline of that joke. Please post a rating of 0 through 5 in the comment section below. I would appreciate it. My cats would appreciate it. My neighbor would appreciate it. Okay there, McGillicuddy, are you... Ready for the joke? I used to be great at telling jokes, but now I only punch up the screw line. Uh, I bet you're glad you waited for that. Anyway, have yourself a lovely Friday indeed, my friend. You truly, truly rock. Today's much coveted must. Today's much coveted must. <laughs> Today's much coveted, much prized winner of the week trolls. Pah. Pah.